What is up, everybody? I've been playing more Ochako lately, and the people keep saying that there's like a hidden buff to her beta. I haven't noticed it personally, but I do notice the buff to the alpha. Alpha is pretty cool, but I don't think this character I, I, I is worth it still. I don't like, I've been having better games with her for sure this season. Here. However, I don't think Friends. that. I would probably put her Please over another character, just because I just she's just in that range of like having to do too much work, and I'm starting to think that even if you did replace her beta, or if you okay, like gave the back the, the like if we put her back to the way she was before she got nerfed, uh, I I don't even know that I would play her honestly. I I really don't. Uh, I think it just might be an issue with like the character itself at this point, but um, I, I, if you guys have noticed the, the beta change that wasn't mentioned in the patch notes, uh, please let me know. Please tell me if, if you've seen it, but we get a gamma, we are able to get the full combo, we get the alpha in, and then we drop the gamma, get another alpha in into the beta, which is the bread and butter combo for Ochako. It's really nice. And if you don't know, I still have a, I still have the Ochako guide up, and I, the Ochako guide is just, you know, it's still relevant, it still matters, even though the beta isn't as strong as it used to be. It's like everything from that guide is still pretty oh, useful, so cute. feel free to check that out Probably if you need you know. to. I am gonna go zip up here, and we're trying to like attack from above. Shigaraki didn't know that we were over here. How and this is one of the other things that I really stuff. hate this about Ochako. It's like that Gamma whiffed. Why did that a Gamma whiff? Because he was too close to a building? He was underneath the Gamma. He should have gotten hit. But it is what it is. We ended up catching him. And then we are able to pick up some more rainbows. So we're going to dump them into our 9 and 4. And here I'm canceling my jump and melee into into my uh beta there nice so positive. that's you can that's something you can do to get your beta to come out really quickly if you just want to melee into beta all for one was doing something on top of that and i was trying to hit him but unfortunately we didn't get him and then there was a three-man team just running with their hands held together <laughs> kind of scares me here so i'm just gonna dip away because i really don't want to get hit by that like a whole team especially with the chocolate having such a little life it's just not it's not ideal so we're gonna get away i'm gonna try to heal. heal and my teammates are dying but i don't and not really much i can do i can't really just jump back in there but there a somebody's popping a full shield i would have jumped in earlier had i known that shield was going or if he even had that shield but that's okay we're going to just try to get into this action. There's the AFO from earlier. And we're going to dodge the AFO. So we waited. I rolled once. And then I rolled again after the down. circle they're went away. Own, and that's a good way to get away from the AFO oh, gamma. Down. If you I'm don't know how to dodge all for one's gamma, that is the way to do it. Just wait for the gamma to disappear. The red line. The red circle on the floor. And then roll. So we hit a gamma. We get the alpha in there and we weren't able to get the beta to the connect which is back. a bit of an issue with this character too the verticality on her beta just makes it so hard to combo all this and it's just adding a bit more to that work that you have to do in order to get the results that you want we're gonna re revive our teammate here there's all that loot you're welcome now let's see if we can jump back into the mix Oof, that, I'm surprised I didn't get knocked over by that Dobby trap. I know you can spin it and, like, t t hit the hit the trap so that nobody gets knocked down by it, but I really thought that he was just gonna cook me with that and I'd fall over. But that was not the case here. I missed, I hit the beta once and then I missed the second, the follow-up hits. And we were able to hit him again. There's the circle. We wait for the circle to go away and then we roll it. So he wasn't able to hit us, but his lobby teammate is just putting in so much work right now. So we have to get some distance here. And we got healed. So we could go back in, but then I heard this Deku up here. And Deku seems like he's by himself. I don't want him taking shots from above either. So I'm going to chase him up there. He's rolling. He's trying to stay alive. He's trying to gamble whip. I don't know if that gamble whip was for me or if that was for him trying to get away, but it doesn't matter. 
because we are going to catch him in our gamma. And I'm just going to keep spinning here. He doesn't really know how to wake up and do beta, which would have stopped me from spinning. And, you know, that attack is armored, but that's his loss. Dobby trying to help him. We don't want that either. Dobby outside of the circle, so he can't revive on his own. And then we see this person just <laughs> healing on the corner over here. So I, instead of healing in front of them, I'm just going to poke them a little bit because I still have, like, full HP. I'm not going to chase them. I know they're weak, but I need to help my teammates over here. So that's why I decided to just stay with this fight and not go chasing a random Dobby. I know a lot of times with speed characters, people just love to run off and just not, you know, participate in the team battles where, you know, your teammates don't have the same speed that you do. So you got to stick around, got to play as a team and help them out. We do get the down. We do spend to win on the body. Ooh, there's a nice little team heal there. So gonna, I need to drop these cards or start using them. I don't know why I'm holding on to so many cards. There goes an A of O. And we go with spinning. He is out of there. So now we go up. And then I hear somebody above me. They were walking in the middle and I could hear it. So I just put my gamma there. And yeah, I got the hit on him. So <laughs> gamma is really nice for using it when you can't like see people. So same goes for like if somebody was like around the corner and you know they're around the corner but you can't see them you can just place a gamma on the floor on your side of the map or your I side of the, the wall there and yeah just you could hit them especially with gamma being buffed and a lot bigger since season uh three sorry i couldn't think of what season she got uh nerfed and changed but yeah it was it wasn't 2.5 it was i was expecting it to happen in 2.5 but it wasn't until season three so denki here is betaing us and we're almost die we almost died for it if i didn't melee him so i had to quickly just start meleeing him as soon as i was able to we i feel like we would have definitely died because like gamma would have taken too long to go off the beta is no longer instant on startup so we had to melee since hey, he was right next to us Yay. and that i believe saved me from because from dying yeah. i'd have to like slow down the video and rewatch it but i'm pretty sure i didn't die because of that so here is a Shigaraki. We're gonna lift him. We're gonna try to combo him, and then now I'm getting hit again. I need to figure out where I'm getting hit from, and then reassess the situation. But now we're just gonna heal. There's not many that, that many teams left. We get a two for a one right here, and my teammate is also beaming, which is really nice. Dobby popping that plus ultra, maybe a little too early, but I was Fuck, in the I air, in recovering the air. from the air beta, and I was not able to roll on the ground. So we did get caught by the AFO gamma, which is not helpful and here goes the I'm afo the going again. again i just tried to alpha upwards and it was just not not a good time so i really just need to be careful and like stay on the ground if afo is like nearby because i just have a feeling he's gonna spam it and he could do it three times in a row he could do gamma turn it on uh another you know gamma for another afo like if he had the afo quirk set he could do gamma on his base set, AFO on the Bro, I'm already at like one or AFO five. gamma on the quirk set, and then he go back to his base set and do gamma again, and that's yeah, you get three that way, and that's really, really scary, especially if somebody's like near you, so or if you're near him. Sorry. Does anyone counter AFO? But we are a okay. I see a res going off, and I see two people coming out, so we're just gonna gamma them from above. They don't know that we're up there. And then I see the AFO again, so I'm just gonna zip away. <laughs> and then I need I need to find this AFO. I, I gotta get rid of him. But somebody jumps up. It's a froppy. We don't want to give her free damage. We're just going to swing at her. Make sure that she does not touch us, because we still need to heal. So we're fully healed up. I'm almost two percent away from plus ultra. I don't even think I'm gonna need the plus ultra really. And there's froppy able to catch her. And our combo is ruined because plus ultra. That's that sucks. So I'm gonna chase for a little bit just to see where she went, but I see the Stabi and the Dobby did not run into the gamma, which was so bad for me. I thought they were trying to run away, so I just assumed too far in advance like where they were going to lead. We catch the Froppy again, gamma break. I didn't hit my second alpha, but that's okay. I'm pretty sure they would have flipped out before the beta anyway. 
And then now I'm dealing with the AFO. I'm going to roll the AFO, okay. which was beautifully done because, like, I tried. I didn't gamma anywhere. I, I didn't grapple up anywhere. I just stand on the ground, and then we rolled. So here we got the gamma combo on the on the Dobby, and we roll okay. again. I am sick of getting grabbed by AFO. Stop it. So we get the jump, and then as soon as we land, I see it goes away. Yeah, that ability is not So we don't have to just stay on the ground the entire time. It's happening. We can jump. We can have a little bit of movement. We just have to be careful and make sure we are ready to dodge, which we were. And here's AFO's plus chaos. I throw my beta at him to interrupt him and stop him from doing gamma. This character, if he's getting looked at, his gamma is not so scary. I promise. Even if you're not going to look at his camera, is not that scary. So this is kind of one of the things that's keeping me from thinking that All for One is high tier. Or, sorry, not high tier, but like the best in the game. I know a lot of people are saying that his gamma is cheap and broken and blah, blah, blah. I really don't think it is, especially since I've showed you like how you can get away from it so easily. You just have to be mindful that he's around because otherwise, yes, you will get grabbed if you're just jumping around in the air all over nearly. But I don't, I don't think all for one is, is cheap or broken. I do think that with a good team comp and with some beamers or even like a compress, yeah, he can get a lot of damage in before you even die. However, that requires teamwork. And there are some other things in this game that do require teamwork. And you can get the same results, such as Denki Sun or the Chaco Gamma or even the Mount Lady Stomp. Like there's, there's a ton of crowd control abilities that will get you something close to what you know yeah, afo yeah, sure. does or if not better but that was game one and we're gonna go see the stats i believe i had 7k damage uh, i, I don't remember how many kills i had but it was a lot it was it was a decent yeah. amount and we're going to go ahead and oh we had nine kills yeah we're gonna go ahead and get ready for game number two All right, so here we have game number two. Oh, you found Already cut out all what? the looting part for you, so you can see me nice. just picking up my last bit of loot huge. before we were about to deal and get into some action. Deal some damage and get into some action. Oh, I hate running around as a speed character without having... I forgot that this was in this game. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I think, I think that Shiggy got abducted. Okay. Well, <laughs> he ascended to heaven. So anyway, <laughs> uh, we're just throwing some alphas on the floor. I'm comfortable uh, using all three. I do have level nine. And I know I'm going to get it back fast. I just wanted to get some damage here. Gravity and we throw our gamma out there just to see if we can catch anybody. But it does not look like that's going to be the case. I tried to throw my gamma here. Unfortunately, the auto aim Oh put it God. right on top of Deku, on? so in Deku moving at sprint speed, it was never going to catch unless I had an increased gamma range, which needs to be higher than 4, and I don't have that, so I think I'm just going to take these levels, and I should just, I don't know why I'm holding on to these rainbows, I should just put, dump them into 7, or into my gamma so I can have 7, but maybe I just don't feel like yeah, finagling with the menu involved. if I know that somebody else is around, which I could definitely understand. There's two people here. I'm spinning, I'm spinning, I'm spinning. The car the car doesn't look that big to me. It looks about to be the same size as it was before. I'm not sure. But like I said, maybe I'm wrong. So if you, if you notice a difference, uh, please tell me in the comments and section. Or if somebody's made a video comparing the two, I'd, I'd love to see that because I just can't. I didn't really play with her after the nerf. And I just can't tell now. I still am not really that interested in playing her. I, the gamma makes it, or the alpha buff makes it fun, but like, like I said, I'm just not sure. Oh, Here, Toby's gonna pop plus chaos, Wonder but thankfully we. we can we can keep up with her. She can't get it really uh, away from us, especially since we're we were already the fastest character in the game. Now we're even faster because of the alpha recharges. And yeah, you see the alpha is just coming okay. back immediately right there. Oh, I should have grabbed the team heals. This Toga really thinks she's getting away. Unfortunately for her, she is not. We're going to hit her with the combo. We couldn't end it with the beta. I, I just don't know why. It works why are you why it doesn't. It? Maybe it's what? just a spacing thing. If I was closer, probably. She did hit us with one part of the beta. I expected her to wake up beta, which is why I went jumping. 
and that is a real combo if you do full melee into alpha you, you can definitely get I that off have but she died here so i wasn't able to do it and even if i was i think my alpha just went off yeah, in a weird direction the, uh, I, I wouldn't be surprised this game yeah. is f filled with so many bugs especially bugs from yeah, like season one a team team size all up. i mean that's okay fix. Ibarra, please fix Kendo. And if you're asking what's wrong with Kendo, Kendo can use her alpha, and it uses up all of her alphas for some reason. I don't... <sighs> anyway, Ochako, Ochako, we're on Ochako. <laughs> so I go over here to box. We see two people. I lift, I combo. They're both down. We have a vehicle that's going to thirst both of them. Can I clean up these? This is one thing I really miss about the vehicle: just spamming that beta and just clearing down bodies it's so nice i'm just gonna dump my rainbows into my out oh. into my red alpha i'm here. just I'm, I'm feeling it right now we're zipping we're gliding we're moving we got 2.6k damage we got four ko's already and there's still four teams left so i'm just looking for my next I mean, yeah, it was this point. Low. here we go over here by the mall area i'm gonna fly into here see this deku we almost got him hit by the shield if momo kept going just a little bit more we missed the momo here we grapple onto her and at this point i don't care that the deku is weak I just momo is an easier target for me since she has less mobility plus she's a counter to my character because it makes it really difficult for me to get close to her so beta and stuff doesn't work and i have to land gamma but like landing gamma on a momo who knows you're there especially uh, it should be that I, I don't know how I get away with so many gammas because the like, gamma is actually reactable. I it's not as reactable as no, AFO, but man, the amount of times that this off. thing lands when somebody is just like running in neutral and just aren't doing anything, it's, it's, it's kind of crazy. Also, uh, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of crazy. I'm surprised really by how many people hit, as well. gets hit by this. So we do hit another gamma. I wasn't able to get full combo. That's okay. And we see the froppy trying to go inside. Or that's not a yeah, that is a froppy. So we were picking her up. Right, so we're pulling her down, and she lands above. Now we're going in for the thirst. Whack, 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 whack. Yeah, and get that full team heal. We pop that immediately team. because we see that both of our teammates no problem using a team are missing either shield and, and or HP. So go ahead and take that. Yeah, take take care of that for them. And I don't, you may have noticed, but I'm running around as a solo this game. I haven't really been staying with my teammate, especially since Davi isn't really that mobile like it doesn't really have I should have rolled that I'm actually upset with myself I could have rolled that that's on me oh, but dead. there's a plus ultra this is looking that's really scary somehow. I don't and do I get away yes okay holy we were able to get away oh, but yeah like I was saying about my teammates I just I'm not kid. sticking holy, around them in this mat match and I was just talking about how I need to in the first game, hey, look, do, do, don't do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> Is that the same? <laughs> but there's so many people in there. There's a couple of guard breaks. I want to get back in there. Deku, stop shooting me with your cool outfit. Nobody cares. He's down. We're going to go up because we're missing so much shield. And our teammate is just getting actually. busted up down there. So I take a look. I'm going to try to pop this, but it's just too late. Okay, down. I'm still going to drink it for the compressed though. I'm just I not able to pull it off, and he was able to get the self-revive, so I wonder if I oh, just restarted the, the drink. Maybe I would have been... Maybe everything would have been better for him. It would have been okay. He probably could have survived. I didn't think about that. That's... Uh, you know what? That's actually good food for thought right there. Wait to see if he could pop it, because I could have seen if he was like losing health or something. Anyway, we come outside, we pop a gamma, somebody's trying to get away from us. I don't want that happening. So we miss our alpha, it's okay. We land the second one, we got our other alpha back, and now we are spinning hey on the twice, and we have three alphas. Wait for my beta to reload. The, press how fast again. alphas come back is crazy. I don't know why I didn't hit that. I, I don't know why that. I didn't hit that one either. Something weird's going on, especially since I have auto aim. I even. <sighs> I swear I was just on an angle where I didn't even need to move the stick. It, it should have hit, but either way, we throw the vehicle at him. Twice it's down. Get him out of here. And now I need to go focus on reviving my teammate right, because team. we both have rest cards, but we are still missing a Dobby. And every person counts in a game like this, even if you don't. 
have all of your all of your levels like you you still matter even like there are some special actions that also really matter on certain characters even if they're at level one toga's a great level one character she can get away with a lot of stuff but we are chasing this twice again i'm spinning i'm spinning i'm spinning i could have did an alpha after that i just there's so much i could have did off that and i just didn't do anything i just kind of stared at him after i threw it i think the reason was because i was expecting him to fall down and there's the combo that i was talking about earlier with the full melee i did the full melee kicked him into the air and i was able to hit him with the alpha and then he decides to go into plus chaos because Bro, he probably I can't took too much damage. Him, and then I also didn't know about the combo so once he got hit by that he probably panicked but i was unable to stop him from doing a small heal I lost where he went, and now we're getting hit by him, and right. I'm weak. I'm weak as hell. So I'm going to spit on him, make him try to get back up off me. We did get the crack on him, and I'm going to pop this team heal because, yeah, Dobby's down again. And I can't stop popping this because my HP is so low that I just, I, I just gotta... I can't really marinate like that on this character, seeing how we only have 250 oh, HP. I into that. The difference between marinating on a okay. <laughs> no HP character and a character that has like 400, the max HP character, it's, it's so night and day. It's so vastly different. It's not over. And sometimes I wonder if marinating is even worth it though, because with the, a lot of people that just come out and grief you just to die, just for that one kill, they don't even care if they win the game or not. They just want to get that one kill on you. They see you out there. So. Is what it is. My teammate did go down. I'm sorry about that. I just I needed the heals. He, they have a res card. I want to pick up that res card. Compress yeah, is jumping away, I'm and I know that compress is weak. So I'm trying to just catch them, and that's not happening. We weren't able to dodge because we got frozen. So I wanted to dodge, but getting frozen like that, it, you know, I'm I'm wondering if I did roll and just didn't get sucked in. And then just ate the... I, I don't know what happened there exactly. Because I feel like I should have got pulled in. But... Uh, who knows? So we do get blasted out of the circle. But I think the circle is coming somewhat towards us. So that's good. Where's the but I need to find time to heal. With. I gotta get my shields up. And I have to make sure that my HP stays tip top. In case I have to go outside of the circle again. Because I'm not... I, I need every bit of HP. But they are down. I'm trying to thirst. We do get the thirst. That's a lot of rainbows. Now I just want to reposition. Just get a good grasp <laughs> this guy. on what's going on in the circle. And I think we should be okay. I'm gonna go pick up that loot here in just a second. But however, I need to finish healing. There are two red cards there, which is beautiful. I'm gonna be able to bring my teammate back again. So we pop the res card. We dump all of the rainbows. We don't need those. And now we pop Gamma, which does miss. So, yay! <laughs> yay for terrible accuracy on my part. So, I'm gonna jump up. Yeah, I'm playing with uh, people I've never played before, by the way. These are these are random, so I'm not with anybody in particular. But we're gonna fall here. We're gonna see the twice. I'm hiding in between. I don't know where he plans to go next. Where art thou, Romeo? There he is. I'm not even going to bother trying to hit him with the alpha in the air, considering the first, I don't know, oh two or God. three attempts I, I did earlier, outside. where I just wasn't hitting him, so it's it's fine. We'll, we'll just go for gamma. So we do hit the gamma, we slam it back down, we hit him with the alpha, 85, and it, that, that was a ch decent chunk of damage. Just getting, what, 91 of the... 270 uh no i think you gotta take a couple 260 yeah 260 damage for hitting one gamma and like not even doing the full combo it's not that bad not too shabby we do roll this we're not trying to get hit by afo and gamma i get that mess out of here i do wish i could have hit him with the karma and swinging it up would have been cool it would have interrupted him then stopped me from having to worry about it but it's all good compress gets him and that will be the end of this game so tell me, yeah, tell me guys what you think of Chaco. Is she worth it now? Is the alpha buff enough? Did she actually get a, a shadow buff to her beta? Does anybody <laughs> who plays this character like way more regularly than I do know? Because I don't. I am not 
Sure. So, <laughs> I've been playing a lot of AFO, which now the next video will probably be. AFO's just been a lot of fun. I've been having this guy so bro. much fun with that character. <laughs> but there it is. The 7,000 game. We had a 8 7K KOs. Game. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. KOs Thank you so much, everybody, for watching. And I will see you Yee! in the next one. a combo for AFO besides Gamma Beta Alpha? Um, if they don't have shields, you can do melee.